everyone feeling for New York, and that was no different as the Giants played at the Chiefs. Uh, the New York Giants playing pretty much for all of New York, but they found that they really were not alone out of the heartland because I think it's one of the most moving things I've seen. Them. Look, they're already cheering in Kansas City. <laughs> That's for the Giants, okay? And you know how That's they great. love their Chiefs with the Reds. Great job, Kansas City, and great job at so many of the parks around the NFL. The commissioner, as we said, on hand, the military, and the emotion on the field and in the crowd definitely felt and will not be forgotten. And then they played football. The Giants led 3-0. Kansas City going in to take the lead until Trent Green throws high. Sean Williams picks it off. Big turnover for the New York football Giants. Ensuing possession, Kerry Collins. Now, Kerry was picked off, but at times, look, he finds Joe Jurevich's 13 yards. And then that's a pretty good-looking play to Tiki Barber. Yeah, and they work Tiki Barber to the outside, as they do oftentimes the lightning element in Thunder and Lightning. And this is the tight end, Dan Campbell, on a little cross, 22 yards. And then when you're moving like that, then you can give it to Lightning. That's Tiki. 13 yards to the 10. Nice interior blocking by the Giants you saw yep. at the head of the play on a reverse pull. And then Ron Dane, as we get to the second quarter, 80-yard drive, 10-0 Giants. I was going to say, Collins was picked off three times, but he was 20 of 24 passing. Yeah, you take a look at Glenn Parker and his block as he comes across the formation. Going to get a nice kick out right there. Ron Dane gets a chance to turn it up just inside the tackle and get to the end zone. But here's what the Giants bring when they're playing best, and that's defense. Keith Hamilton wraps up Trent Green. The score 13-0 in the third. Green goes long, and here's a good-looking rookie, Marvin Snoop Minnis. But unfortunately, after hauling it in for 49 yards, he was quite wobbly, and you can see why. As his head hit the turf, thank goodness it's a real grass. He would not return in this game. 13-3, the Chiefs trying to make a run. Trent Green will, in the fourth quarter, on third and three, keep it for a first down. Third and five at the 32. Green for Tony Richardson. Oh. Dick Vermeil says, well, let's pull to within seven, but it's going to be a 49 yard field goal for Todd Peterson. No good. And the Giants would run out the clock. Hug from Jim Fossil and Dick Vermeil, and a together prayer on the field and in the stands. Very classy performance in Kansas City and a very classy performance by the New York Giants, who every day they went to practice looked across the river and could see the forever changed skyline of New York City. The Giants, as they said earlier and as they say after the game, playing for a city that they would not disappoint. I wanted us to come out and just play in a way that would make New York proud, really. And I think that's, that's what it really comes down to. And uh, we wanted to win that game for a lot of different reasons. One of them is, is you know, it was going to brighten a lot of people's day back there in New York. But um, uh, really, I think the important thing is is you want to play the way that you think will make them play. The game that we play is a game. Uh, the, you know, this isn't a matter of life or death. You know, yes, it is our job, but it's also, it's a game. And, you know, the people that lost their lives, the people that were at work, uh, the firemen, the policemen, and all the volunteers that were there helping people to try and survive this tragedy, you know, those are the ones that, you know, really need to be commended.